The journey of Apple from beginning to end is quite interesting, isn't it? Some guys get together and revolutionized the computer world by achieving immense success. However, Steve Jobs has the company taken from him by traditional business types. After they took the company near to failure, these businesses begged Steve to return, and the most interesting thing is, he did. His skills and personality not only help return Apple to success, but make it the most envied name in all of business. The company that urges you to think different is full of more surprises than you think. While it has become a well-known fact that Steve Jobs shaped Apple, and the way the company is reaching to its new heights is a remarkable one. But there are some quite interesting things that I am sure you've never heard at all. So if you're an Apple enthusiast and looking to find out interesting things about Apple, you must watch this video. Hello guys, this is Connor from TechLocker, and today in this video, we'll look at the top 10 interesting things about Apple that you didn't know. Hey, wait. Before starting our video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get notified of our latest videos. So let's get started. Number 1. Apple have more money than the US Treasury. According to several reports, it is found out true that the United States Treasury has around $171 billion on hand right now. Well, this might seem as a lot of money to you, but believe me, Apple has more than that. The tech brand that we all love has more operating cash than the US Treasury to run the government. And do you know what the worst part is? It's not even close. The company has almost $250 billion in cash on hand. That's enough money to buy an iPhone for every American right now. Wait, not only this, Apple could even buy Twitter, Facebook, Uber, and more. Number 2. Apple chooses Airways to take their products first class to customers. Instead of choosing the shipping assembled products from China through Seaways, Apple is quite unique. This tech brand takes its manufacturing products and flies all of it. We all know it's expensive, but it has several advantages. By arriving on average in 15 hours, they get on shelves quickly and Apple doesn't have to pay interest on its investment in them. Steve Jobs thinks that there are less chances of being hijacked and meeting with catastrophic accidents compared to ship. Because of their fixation with flying, Apple is Cathay Pacific's biggest corporate customer. Number 3. Apple actually had three founders. We all know that Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak together started and created the first Apple computer in Woz's parents' garage. But did you know there was another guy working along with them? Well, it was Ronald Wayne, who was a friend of Jobs who agreed to start working with him. Not only did he help develop the computer, he wrote its manual and even came up with Apple's first logo. When he realized that Apple is not going to work out, he left the company by acquiring his own assets. He sold his share of the company to the Steves for $800 million, which we all think was a very bad move. If he hadn't sold his shares earlier, they would be worth around $40 billion in today's time. After the sale, Wayne now sells stamps and coins. One interesting thing is that he didn't own a single Apple product until someone gave him an iPad in 2011. Number 4. The first Apple logo featured Isaac Newton. Although the now retro rainbow logo is probably Apple's most popular and well-known, the very first Apple logo featured Sir Isaac Newton sitting under a tree with an apple about to hit his head. The Newton logo was designed by the lesser-known Apple founder Ronald Wayne. Yes, the same guy who sold his stake for $800 and was only used briefly in 1976 since its high level of detail didn't really show up that well when shrunk down and stuck on a product. The rainbow apple, designed by Rob Janoff, replaced Sir Isaac and remained the symbol of the company for many years until the simpler monochromatic apple logo was introduced in 1998. Number 5. Apple has 9.41 AM written on every iPhone commercial. If you've seriously watched the Apple iPhone commercials, the time displayed is 9.41 AM. Have you ever thought why? Did you know that I in iMac originally stood for internet? Well, this letter leans toward innovation or imagination, but this is true. There are several other symbols that Steve Jobs has made over the years that generated curiosity in everybody's mind, and one of this is seriously a gem. On iPhone commercials, the time on the phone is always 9.41 in the morning. 
If you don't know the truth, let me tell you. It's the time when the first iPhone was unveiled on January 7, 2007. Of course, at 9.41 a.m. Number 6. Apple believes in lucky outfits, which explains Jobs' iconic turtleneck, jeans, and new balances. One of the best things that all people liked about Steve Jobs is that he made an impression on every major public appearance by always wearing the same outfit. His uniform, that consisted of a black St. Croix mock turtleneck, Levi 501s, and New Balance cross trainers, made it easy to recognize and identify with him. Even though Steve Jobs is not there with us, the tradition still continues and it will be continued in the future. Apple's senior vice president of industrial design and the company's public face wears the same t-shirt which is of the same style, color, and manufacturer for every one of his public appearances. Number 7. Steve was adopted by Paul and Clara Jobs. Did you know that Steve Jobs is the legitimate son of a Syrian immigrant? Few people know that Steve Jobs was adopted, and even fewer know that his father was Abdul Fattah Jandali that got Joanne Schiebel pregnant in college. Due to some parental issues, he was put up for adoption, and although the mother insisted the baby be adopted by educated people, young Steve was adopted by Paul Jobs, a high school dropout, and Clara Jobs, who hadn't finished college. Number 8. The first iPod had a secret Easter egg. Apple's first iPod came with a little secret, an Easter egg, in the form of a game that could be easily accessed if you knew the right combination of buttons to press. When one of the reviewers was rushing to buy an iPod, they also found that it came with a secret. In his review for Geek.com, Nick Triano wrote, Go to the About menu, hold down the center button for about 3 seconds, and you'll get a breakout Pong game to play while you listen. Nobody knew that there's a game inside an iPod, but Breakout was noteworthy because Steve Jobs and Wozniak worked together on at Atari where legend has it, Jobs cheated Wozniak out of thousands of dollars of bonus money. Number 9. Steve Wozniak is still an Apple employee. Woz started to hate Apple as it got bigger and also hated the management duties running inside the management. After meeting with an airplane crash in 1981, he stopped showing up to work regularly and officially quit full-time employment in 1987. But he remained as an employee of Apple by working firstly on a universal remote control and then reduced his official role to being an ambassador of sorts, shilling the Apple name at public and private appearances. He no longer actively works for Apple, but is still officially an Apple employee and receives a stipend of $120,000 a year next to his income from Apple stock. Number 10. The size of Apple headquarters, really big. Did you know? The size of Apple headquarters is 175 acres, or 71 hectares. On this head office campus, more than 12,000 employees work under a single roof. We can say that approximately 260,000 square meters central building houses thousands of employees. It was Steve Jobs who wanted to make Apple headquarters like a nature refuge instead of office park. There's even more to know about Apple, much of it fascinating and some of it surprising. So guys, this was our video on the top 10 interesting things about Apple that you didn't know. Let us know which interesting thing about Apple did you like the most. Drop your wonderful thoughts in the comments section below and we will be happy to hear from you. And if you are a fan of our videos, then be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Thanks for spending your quality time with us.